game side. There's going to be some sort of split action to cause some confusion. Kleba to inbound. Kleba looking in for Irving. Irving for the win! See the sun is setting here officially at 7:31 p.m. Showing you an assistant coach for the Celtics pointing to their watch, probably indicating that very thing. Kyrie Irving going to the back. Now we all know that he has fasted in the past. He has said publicly he wants to keep things private about his Ramadan observance. But I will tell you this: if he is fasting, he had to wait till sunset before he could intake any food or liquid. And as we just told you, sunset just passed. I spoke with an athlete who has played during Ramadan while he was observing. And he told me that when he played games and the sunset happened during the game, he would in fact go and get something to eat immediately. Something small and light, high in sugar, normally fruit like grapes or oranges to give him a quick injection of energy. Because you guys, it's been 13 hours and 36 minutes since sunrise and sunset. If he is fasting that entire time, no food, no liquid, and that includes water. because I wanted to get to something about the one and only Kyrie Irving. Where despite fasting for Ramadan, Kyrie Irving put on a show in Dallas Sunday against the Denver Nuggets. Irving hit a clutch 21-foot left-handed hook shot behind the free throw line over Nikola Jokic to beat the Denver Nuggets. Here's the play right here. Look at that right there. That's Kyrie Irving. Everybody can't do that, but he can. That's why he's Kyrie. The spectacular play had players and fans going crazy on X, formerly known as Twitter. Kyrie finished playing 40 minutes, 24 points, 7 rebounds, 9 assists. Again, this all happened during Ramadan, where Muslims observe a strict fast from dawn until sunset. They're not allowed to eat or drink, not even water, during daylight hours. Didn't stop Kyrie Irving from answering the call, though. Kyrie, on a personal note, you have said that you are fasting for Ramadan, which, for those who are unaware, means no food, no water from sunup to sundown. How do you muster the energy to go out and score 34 points with very little nutrition in your body? Well, it's a journey with God, and I'm not alone in this. I have brothers and sisters all around the world that are fasting with me. Uh, we, we hold our prayers and our meditations very sacred. And when you come out here, I mean, God's inside me, God's inside you, God's inside all of us. So I'm walking with faith, and that's all that matters. And when I get a chance to do this in this type of arena and, and showcase my talents that have been granted to me strictly from God, I'm humbled. So he's not letting me score 34 to must win, I'll tell you that. Congratulations, Kyrie. Thanks, thanks, brother. BA. All right, thank you, Jared. Kyrie Irving. Well, all praise is due to God, Allah, for this. Um, you know, because it's, it's just been a, a lot of just outside. Like I said, there's a lot of people in other people's business all the time. Um, but for me, in, in terms of my faith and, and what I believe in, um, you know, being part of uh, the Muslim community, being uh, committed to Islam, and, and also just being committed to uh, all races and cultures, religions, just having an understanding and a respect. I just want to put that as the foundation. You know, there's such a divisive uh, energy out here or just it's been that way in our society. It's just so divisive. You know, if you're Muslim and, you know, the Christians and Jews and all this, I don't want to get into all that, but it's just bringing that into the game. I, I, I don't want to, but obviously a lot of people have questions. Um, but yeah, I am taking part in Ramadan with a lot of my brothers and sisters, my Muslim brothers and sisters, and it's been an adjustment. That's really what I can say, just being um, committed to my service, to God, Allah, and then continuing on um, with whatever I'm guided with. So, you know, just happy to, to be part of my, my community and doing the right things. So fasting is definitely part of it. Uh, obviously, if you know anything about the Muslim community, um, but yeah, I'm just, just really blessed and grateful to, to be taking part in this.